Dude, you know what? You know what feels really know. good. It's pretty good though. I fucks with it. What feels you really know. good? Uh, Side so beat your meat. <laughs> Tanami. A a and, uh, a tooth that re that needs a root canal. Uh. That that it feels really good right now. I mean, yeah, I mentioned this earlier, but I've never have a cat, and I it's not like I'm like super a huge stickler about taking care yeah. of my teeth or anything like. I think I'm just lucky or have good genetics or something because I, uh, I, I I'll tell you, that. I'll tell you straight up. I've had, this will be my 10th root canal. These Damn. all right there and all right here are all, are all veneers because they were all root canals and it was cheaper. It was the cheaper option, expensive as veneers. It was, it was the cheaper option for me to get this. So mm. the reason why my teeth are so fucked up is, uh, I was born, okay, first off, I was born with only one salivary gland or, like, one less salivary gland than everybody else, so right. so keep that in mind, and I was born without any, no, 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 uh, they gave me the wrong formula whenever I was a kid, and it destroyed all of the enamel in my teeth, and the enamel protects your right. teeth protects from your teeth. all the sugar right. and all that, it's like a fucking shield, so... Right. Without the saliva and the enamel, anything that I was eating or drinking was just staying on there so much more than the average person. Right, so right. my teeth, like probably two years ago, were like if you flicked it, like a chip would come off. That's crazy. Yeah. And it so got to the point where... Living I, I was, nightmare that everybody has of like your teeth getting fucked up and you're and have you ever had one of those where your teeth get like fucked up and they fall out and shit? You were just like living that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. I would be eating like random shit, and then uh like my tooth would just fucking break, and then I would be in extreme fucking pain because it's a it, it's a bare fucking tooth like being exposed. Right. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, I've only ever had like wisdom tooth pulled. And that that was not. I have fun. a wisdom tooth coming in right here, but I need it because I had this tooth taken out because it was fucked up. Mm, gotcha. Yeah, I had I had uh, this one I think taken out like a year ago or something. Mm. Uh, and also, I made the horrible mistake of going to a dentist instead of an orthodontist. So like at the just the dentist office, they don't put you under. They they just apply like some kind of. Uh, what does they call it? Like local sedative, not local sedative, local anesthetic or something like that, to like numb your mouth. Yeah, they do the numb like, shots in your mouth, on, right, like yeah. in like in your gums. I don't know if I'm just like. No, you can still feel it. I don't. That I don't only know if I'm like predisposed to not having that stuff work super great on me, but like they stuck that shit in my mouth so many fucking times, and then, uh, you can feel like them yanking on and like drilling and cracking the fucking yep. tooth on your jaw even though you can't like feel the pain it's still you your can bone still feel it your face and you could feel it right and i had something similar whenever i broke this uh this pinky i had two pins going across here and going Oof. across here and whenever i went to the doctor to pull them out all he did was he stuck some kind of needle in here numbed this area and then he just took literally just went grabbed a pair of pliers and a scalpel sliced it and then just ah. grabbed it. and blood was literally like squirting all over the room <laughs> like, like, like mat that he put my hand on I'm like, like, doc halfway through, halfway through wait, doc. wait wait halfway through he goes this isn't working let me go get the good pair and i was like oh fuck <laughs> dude, dude it wasn't. It really wasn't that bad. I mean, but like watching somebody pull and like blood squirting out of your like fucking hand is not not the best thing to look dude, at. <laughs> dude, this is what they have to do. Uh, I found out like since my teeth are so sensitive. First time I went to a dentist, they were doing like some work, and this is the first time I found out that I, nobody can touch my teeth without me being damn near fucking knocked the fuck out and really, really sed uh, sedated. So right. I went to this new dentist because there was this old one I went to, uh, I used to go to as a as a kid, and then he was the type of dentist that was like, you would come in and then he's like, oh, no brushing, huh? And then he would make you feel like sh like not even like joking, like he would like like mean, like right. angry. He's like, right. why are you here? Your mom keeps bringing you here. She's paying good money. You need to take care of your teeth. This is this is insane. Why are you doing this to your family? 
And I'm like, Jesus, Doc. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Just clean <Straight> my teeth. <laughs> yeah, bro. I had no, a doctor. 